Holomisa warns against the registration of AMCU. UDM leader Bantu Holomisa has warned the Labor Department against its plans to deregister the Association of Mine Workers and Construction Union AMCU, saying it would trigger instability. On Wednesday, the department published a notice in the Government Gazette indicating its plans to cancel the registration of AMCU. Details are still sketchy as to why the department has moved to deregister the influential union, a breakaway from the anchor-lined National Union of Mine Workers, and which rose to prominence in the labor unrest that preceded the 2012 Maracana massacre. Holomisa said the move by the department smelled of political machinations aimed at taming the union. He called on the department to come clean about the reasons for the cancellation against AMCU, which mainly organizes in the platinum sector, with around 200 members. Everyone is surprised by this decision. The department must take the public into its confidence and state the reasons why it is intending to cancel the registration of this union. They must specify the legislation that was violated by the union as well, otherwise this is laced with politics, Holomisa said. According to a notice written by Registrar of Labor Relations, Lalohanolo Daniel Malaf, the cancellation was triggered by the fact that the union has ceased to function in terms of its constitution, and the trade union is not a genuine union as envisaged in the Act. AMCU ended its five-month-long strike at Sydney Stillwater this week, where it initially demanded a R1000 wage hike and eventually settled for the R700 which had been accepted by other unions. Holomisa said the cancellation, which would effectively disable the union from organizing in mines or collecting subscription fees from its members, would create instability in the country and the mining industry.